The FBI says serial killers working as long-haul truckers have killed hundreds of prostitutes, hitchhikers, and stranded drivers in our country. It's such a big problem, agents created a special database just to keep track of these murders and suspected truck drivers. Tulsa police think it's possible a serial killer truck driver killed a woman who hitchhiked from New York to Tulsa last year. News on 6 crime reporter Lori Fulbright has new information in this follow-up. Lori? Well, Jennifer, investigators say serial killers are drawn to a career in truck driving because they can pick up a victim in one place, kill her two states away, then dump her body three states after that. Plus, there are few witnesses and little forensic evidence. Tulsa homicide detectives say that fits Lisa Bulliard's murder to a T. Lisa Bulliard was the mother of a young son when she decided to leave her home in New York and hitchhike to parts unknown. She ended up in Tulsa on April 27, 2009. This is somebody's wife, this is somebody's daughter, this is somebody's mother, and we very much want to solve this. And Lisa was seen at the downtown homeless shelter, then at a women's shelter in Sand Springs, and was captured on surveillance video walking along Charles Page Boulevard after asking directions to the nearest truck stop. We have some uh, questions about truck drivers. She was again caught on tape when this man took her to Tulsa's FBI office where she talked to agents about getting a background check run on herself because she wanted to re-enlist in the Army. Identifying this man is a top priority for police. Detectives want to talk to him and also get a DNA sample. Eight days after her arrival, this is how police found Lisa. Wrapped in a trash bag, mouth and feet taped, tossed in a yard on South Elwood. She'd been dead only five hours, and it was a nightmarish death. She was beaten and cut. Police had only vague reports of a white Chevy truck in the area. So it's very difficult. We have really very little to go on. These red dots are the 500 murder victims found near highways in the past 30 years in America. The cases are in an FBI database along with information about 200 possible suspects. Since Lisa didn't know anyone in Tulsa, police believe her killer was a stranger to her. And given how violent her murder, they believe it's not the killer's first. It's a very brutal death, and, and I, I don't want to go as far out to say this is a serial killer, but this is somebody that I believe has a very violent past and, and can, it could be a person could do this again. The serial killer highway database was created because of an Oklahoma case. The OSBI was working the murders of seven truck stop prostitutes that happened along I-40. Researching similar cases led them to so many, the FBI decided it was important enough to create a separate database to track highway serial killers. Of course, anyone with information about Bullyard's case should call Crime Stoppers at 596-COPS. Lori Fulbright, The News on 6 tonight.